Hi, can you guys hear me? Yes, thank you. All right. Um, my name is Janae. I have three kids and I also pulled my kids out of uh, the school district and full home, uh, homeschooling full time. I'm here to speak on the vaccine mandate for children. This is not a one size fits all. If we really wanted to help the world, how about we force everybody to stop eating processed foods that contain trans fats, preservatives, and glyphosate? But I don't think that would go over well, but people would be healthier. But here we are wanting to mandate an injection into our already toxic bodies, where I believe that we could solve this with healthier eating habits and lifestyle changes. Someone else may believe, may believe that a mask and a shot may save them, but we all believe differently. That is the beauty of living in this country. We live in this country because we have all been given God-given rights that are protected by the Constitution. The world is a better place when we respect each other's freedoms to choose. But here we are trying to force each other to do something that we don't feel is right. It may be right for you and your children, but I don't feel it is right for me or my children. I know you guys are tired of hearing facts and I don't wanna to share too many facts with you, but when I hear the term safe and effective, it triggers an alarm inside. How can they know that it is safe and effective when we do not know the long-term effects? This shot has all only been available for almost a year. Time will tell what is going to happen. As a parent, why would I subject my child to that? My kids are healthy and if they get sick with COVID, that is my choice that I made as their parent, just as it is, just as it is your choice to give them the shot because you feel it protects them. One more thing, do you remember when Merck came out with this so-called wonderful vaccine that was going to cure the world of cervical cancer? That shot was called Gardasil. It was fast track, just like this one. Young people suffered from debilitating effects but they got it because they wanted to do what was right and best for their health. They had the best intentions, just like many do with this shot. No vaccine, especially for children, should ever be fast-tracked. And if it is, we should be given the right to choose whether or not we want to take that chance. I hope you will all consider that we are not here and on this call as domestic terrorists or parents telling you what to do, but we're here asking for choice, choice for everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you, Janae.